תודה רבה, תודה רבה, תודה רבה. תודה רבה, תודה רבה. אני תמיד עושה כבוד להיות עם חברי נתן שרנסקי וכל אלו שעובדים עבור מסע, כל אלו, אנחנו מסתכלים את ה-12th anniversary של מסע, אז זה חפי בת מצווה מסע. מזל טוב. You know, uh, in these 12 years, over 100,000 young Jews from uh, over 60 countries have come here from uh, all over the world. Well, I want to check that. Are any of you from, uh, from Russia? France? The U.S.? Great Britain? Uh, how about Brazil? Canada? What about South Africa? Ukraine? Ukraine has it. <laughs> Venezuela? Australia? Argentina? Mexico. Did I forget anybody? Well, you know, this sounds like the, um, either the Olympics or the Mondial. It is the Olympics. It's the Mondial. It's the Jewish Mondial. It's Massa. And thank you all for being here. I want to tell you something about the place that we're convening in. Now, obviously, this is a modern arena. That's what it's named, the arena. It's uh, brand new, top technology, great sports. But this place, right here, is exactly the place where uh, your fathers and my fathers and your mothers and my mothers came from. You know, I'm talking about Abraham, Isaac, Jacob. You remember these names? Yes. Sarah, you don't know your mother. These are your fathers and mothers. And in fact, the origin of our people came from this place. We are called Jews. Do you know why we're called Jews? Because we came from this place, from Judea. And we're right in Jerusalem. And in Jerusalem, in Jerusalem, you had King David, remember him? King Solomon. He built a temple not very far from here. And the great prophets, Isaiah, Jeremiah, Amos, he lived not very far from here, to the south. This is the hub of our family, of our people, of our nation. This is where the Jewish people came from. This is where much of the Bible was written. This is where the great truths that we gave to all mankind that's where it originated from. This is where so much of the values of humanity, of society, morality, it all came from these hills in a dusty part at the edge of Asia. It revolutionized the entire world, but we never forget that this was our land and we always wanted to come back to our land, and you just did that. So you've come back to the cradle of our people and of civilization, and you see... This is God speaking from above. A voice from the heavens.
you've come back here to what our modern Moses Herzl said is an old new land. It's old, but it's new. You see around you, Israel, you have cell phones? You have cell Does anyone not have a cell phone? When you hold that cell phone, you're holding a piece of Israel. You have flash drives. You have flash drives? That was made in Israel. You eat cherry tomatoes? That's Israel. You use all sorts of wonder drugs? I mean, the good kind, the cure diseases. Let's be straight about that. That's from Israel. This is a country of wondrous technology, wondrous innovation. You know, a lot of um, Seichel. You know what Seichel is? It's brains. But the brains come with a heart, a Jewish heart. And this country is refashioning the future. Now, I know you came here and you participated both in our past and in our future. And I welcome the fact that you, uh, you come here as uh, tech fellows, tech challenge fellows, and English teachers, and startup interns, and medical researchers. And you are experiencing firsthand and adding to the spirit that makes this country great. And it makes this country great in a special way. You can see if you move a little away from here into the larger neighborhood of the Middle East, something very different is going on. And when you're here and you see what's happening here, you understand that Israel is truly a light unto the nations, a light unto the nations, a beacon in darkness that I hope will be dispelled. But we know that the challenges that we face are great. And you know that you're here because something very special is happening here. Because you are the Jewish leaders of tomorrow. And you have much to give. And we appreciate the fact that you are giving yourself a wonderful opportunity, not just to help, but also to learn to learn of your people's history in our ancestral homeland, to learn about the roots that unite all of us as Jews, to learn our language. Any of you picked up some Hebrew? See, I was wondering whether to give this speech in Hebrew, but I figure it's a bit early. Next time you're here, we'll test it. And to see our shared responsibility for the future of the Jewish people and the future of the Jewish people is intertwined with the future of the Jewish state. I think you understand that now. I know that Israel is a better place for all of your efforts. I know that you'll be better people and better leaders for having been here with Massa. Massa will leave you better connected to each other and better connected to Israel. I want to ask you to come back here. Not only again and again, I'm sure you'll do that. See, I want to ask you to come and make Israel your home because Israel is the home of every Jew. And as the Prime Minister of the one and only Jewish state, I want to assure you that every Jew, Orthodox, conservative, reform, secular, anyone, has a home in Israel. This is your home. Welcome to Massah. Welcome to Israel. Come back. Stay in Israel. Thank you very much. So, Darabah, all of you. Thank you.